All right, so I'm going to show y'all how I maintenance my XP 15,000. For right now, this is how I do it. Um, every morning I come in and I do this. Um, it's not nothing major, but this is what I do first thing. So hold on for that. You did. All right, so the first thing I do, I go in here to maintenance. I go to as if I'm changing uh, ink cartridge replacement. Hit next. Start. Let the cards, let the uh, carriage move over a little bit, right? So once you move over, go ahead, unplug your machine. It feels wrong every time I do it, but unplug your machine. That way, it can slide freely across. Don't be too rough with it. Just slide across. Now, I have in here, that's the capping station. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to dip a Q-tip in my cleaner solution and wipe around the sides because ink builds up around the sides and on my wiper blade. So we're going to do that. Let me see if I can keep it all in position to see that. So got me some DTF ink cleaning liquid. I got this from a vendor on Alibaba along with my replaceable cartridges. So I just put some on the tip of this Q-tip. I'm just going to wipe gently around it. And as you can see, a lot of ink, even though you can't see it, accumulates up there. So wipe it with the white side. I even wipe across it sometimes. Don't know if I'm supposed to, but then I take the dry side and just kind of suck up any solution I left lingering around there, if I left any. I typically do this like every day, so it's not that bad. I want to keep getting flawless uh, prints. I, I have had one clog, but I figured it out, which I should have shot a video. But basically, you get a clog, you just want to run your carts with cleaning solution to push all that dry ink through. That worked for me, and I got a few sets of cartridges, and I just switched the cartridges out, and boom. But, um... Yeah, so that's all I'm going to do for that. Cleaned around it. So now, I'm just going to slide this back. And I'm actually about to fill up my ink cartridges. Now, to each his own, do at your own risk. I have been filling up my cartridges in the printer. Um, Just, I've been filling them up very slowly. So I don't spill it. Because if you spill a lot of ink on your print head, it's going to fry up your, your print head fuse. Been there, done that. Don't want to do that. So just be very careful. Because, you know, I might even I might have ink in here already. It might be halfway full and all that. So I might not need a lot of ink. So just got to go really slow. So as you see, I pulled the plug out. See, I, I, I didn't need a lot of blue. Like I barely pushed any out the syringe. And you can see, but I just wanted to top it off. So the blue is good. But I literally just filled these up, I think. But the white's probably low. Because I've been printing white designs. So the white is probably definitely low. And after we do this, we're going to run a head clean it. And we're going to test out our new external waste tank that we just put on. It'll be the first time. And we'll see if it works. Yeah, it did. See if I know what I'm doing over here or if I'm just playing. Folks think you're playing. I'm not playing, though. Because it's not a game. Where's the white one at? Let's see. Well, make sure you put your uh, your plugs back in here, too. Put my blue plug back in. So I'm going to take my white out. And then I'm just, I ain't going to make y'all watch all this. But take each plug out. Slowly fill up each cartridge. And that's equivalent to your ink cartridge replacement. But we'll be right back after I'm finished. After these sponsors, yeah, it is. All right, so 
when you go in you want to make sure that your ink level is set at their full yeah um after you refill your cartridge of course just turn the printer back on i forgot about y'all so <laughs> i missed all that but anywho um turn your printer back on go to maintenance we're gonna do a print head cleaning we're gonna start this is the first time here's my external bottle for my external waste tank we're gonna see if it works fingers crossed y'all first print head cleaning let's see how much ink we go through all right so my print head cleaning was complete um i didn't get no ink y'all so that don't mean it's not working right it might just didn't push out no ink which is weird and it can't be going into the tank because i literally disconnected the hose from the tank so we're gonna run a um i'm gonna print a nozzle head check see what happens all right guys so i did the uh nozzle check everything is good um like i said nothing came out no waste this time but i'm quite sure it will you know i double checked my work everything's good no flooding in the printer so we'll check it out next time but that's my maintenance on the next video we'll do some printing maybe hopping hop into uh, accurate something like that but appreciate y'all rocking with me to the next one i'm out yeah